How's it going everybody? This is Echo Papa and today we're going to talk about an effect called Slicer. Now a lot of people don't fully understand what Slicer was and Slicer is not something that's limited to Virtual DJ. In fact, uh, I was talking to a guy and how I uh, kind of got this idea was um, he didn't understand what Slicer was. He knew that it was something uh, in some other software and you know he saw it as an effect but couldn't figure out how to work it and uh, he wanted to map it to a controller but it didn't seem to do anything when he activated it. So we're going to talk a little bit about uh, about Slicer, uh, what it is and what it does and uh, I'm also going to show you the command to map it. It's really simple. So uh, let's get right to it. Now you can, we're going to go ahead and turn this on. Um, now first of all, uh, I'm going to show you, you can see right here, uh, I have it mapped to a Numark orbit. And originally I had it mapped to one of these. Uh, a Novation Dicer, it, it mapped really easy. Um, uh, the downside is, is because it requires 8 beats, uh, and this only has uh, 5. While it physically worked, it only worked for the first 5 beats, and then you know I kind of had lost the last 3 beats. The upside to the Dicer is that you didn't need to program the LEDs, the, the Dicer did it automatically. For this one here, it was really easy to program the command, but uh, I had to program the LEDs myself, which was just an extra step. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to turn the light off so that you can see it a little more clearer. Now you don't have to have the effect turned on to see it. In fact, let's go ahead and turn the volume off here. I'm going to play this one. You can see this one here. The light is running alongside. Uh, even though I don't have the effect turned on over here. Well, let's go ahead and, and we're going to turn it on. And if you were to hit one of these buttons, it will turn the effect on for you. However, uh, there will be a slight delay while Virtual DJ says, hey, buddy, you don't have the effect turned on, and it turns it on for you. Uh, so let's go ahead and turn the volume back up, and you can see how it sounds. We're going to go ahead and we're going to play our song. And we want to loop one part of it. As long as I hold down this button, it's going to loop just that section. You can jump around. So, so whichever one we select, now to map it, uh, like to map it like we have here to a controller, it's really easy, and I'm gonna show you. Go to your settings, go to your orbit, or go to your controller, wherever your controller happens to be. And here's the command right here. It's slicer and then the number. The number just represents the beat and you list it uh, 1 through 8. So you would basically map, you know, uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Each one of those is going to represent whichever beat it is that you want to loop. Now you can see here, uh, I have them out of order. It's 1, 5, 2, 6, 3, 7, 4, 8. Uh, and the reason it's not 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 is because uh, on this controller, this is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And originally I did have it mapped down. In fact, you can see right here, uh, I have it bank number 3 is mapped that way. Uh, but bank number 2, it's just it's just nicer to see it going downwards you know, than it is to go uh, back and forth like that. Uh, but whichever is easier for you. And if So if you have any kind of grid controller, uh, you can go ahead and, and map it just like this, where it goes down or up or whatever is easiest for you. So the first thing that you might say is, well, I don't have a controller, but I still want to be able to use a slicer. Well, if you come over here and hit the plus, you can see right here that the same buttons right here, one through eight. So let's go ahead and play our song. And you can see the buttons jump along, and it's the same controls, except for, uh, you can see, and they, they match right along with our controller. And if we hit any of them, let's go ahead and number one. You can see it lights up on our controller, and it works in the skin. So anyway, that is the slicer. If you want to get a hold of me, you can find me on Twitter, at DJ Echo Papa. If you like this video, please click the like button. If you really liked it, share it with your friends, or better yet, subscribe. Until next time, I am Echo Papa, and I will talk to you later.